Hello everyone and welcome to The Road to Terry Bogard. We are looking at a uh, kind of ironic game now, considering we're leading up to Smash and on screen right now there are, well, two Smash characters. Uh, there's, there's Ryu and Terry. We're looking at CBS2, Capcom vs. SNK2, because I own this one. I own it on uh, PlayStation 3 via the PlayStation 2 Classics version. And I remember actually seeing this in the arcade, uh, like the arcades back in the day when they were still around and being like, yo, this looks cool. What the heck is an SNK though? Because they, it wasn't very well known here. Um, because this is on PS3, and I don't want to ever touch a disgusting PS3 controller ever again. God, they feel bad now. Uh, I have my fight stick, so you're gonna listen to some clicky clacks and some 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 good old clicky ASMR. Two thousand one is the year we make contact. Is kind of a dope, a dope tagline. I will say the original. Everybody rumored, nobody believed is still kind of the best. Uh, let's hop in. This is the console version, so as such we have stuff like training mode. Uh, there is a color edit mode where you can um, make your own color palettes. We're not doing that because I'd be here forever. Option wise, let's put this quality, this difficulty down. Uh, quick continue we'll put on so that we can continue right away. That sounds good. Um, my controller, I think, is all set up. Yeah, this is that's perfect for my fight stick. Sounds, it just says, put on that stuff. Yep, 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 we're good. Display memory card, we're all dope here. Um, so, arcade mode. It says you play a perfect conversion of the arcade game. You can tell, like, it's, it's made for arcade players with that type of language. They would not say that anymore in a game. Uh, there is the manual as part of it being on the PS3 here, but I'm not going to look at it because there's not much in it. So, let's hop in. We, so we can do the ratio where it's like you can pick one, two, or three characters, and then the opponents you face will be uh, kind of it, one really strong character, two pretty good, or three kind of weak. Um, there's also 3v3, where if you want to create uh, teams of... Ex everyone has three three characters or single rounds, so you basically have a combination of Street Fighter and King of Fighters. King of Fighters or Street Fighter. Uh, this is also, you could think of this as the Skullgirl system. We're gonna go three on three, because I want to do a team of three, and I want everyone else to have a team of three, so we see as many characters as we can. This is the wild thing, though. The Groove Select. These give you different options, so dash, air guard, counter rolling, dash, counter rolling, safe fall, dash, small jump, tactical recovery, run, small jump, counter attack, tactical recovery, dodge. Um, we're gonna go with this one, this is the Garou system, so I wanna just defend. So they're pretty much based on the different, uh, different games there. So we're gonna always pick our boy Terry, and we'll also pick then... Oh, we could be evil Ryu. No, we'll be regular Ryu, and we'll be Ken here. Team Smash Boys, let's go. Ah, uh, just, just one, two, three. Oh wait. Oh no, it's okay. I know you can switch their order, but I'm not gonna hear. Also, hey, Morgan's in this game. This game has an amazing soundtrack. I'm very excited. Live and let die. All right. So this one is the one made by Capcom. Uh, you can tell because of how it looks like Street Fighter. And yes, you are listening correctly. This is the. This is the uh, Friday Night Fisticuff song. No, I love it too. Oh, it's good. I'm gonna be real. It's been a hot minute since I've actually used a, uh, used a fight stick, so I bought it thinking like, man, now I'll get good at fighting games, and then I completely forgot that no, uh, you don't need it to be good at fighting games. You kind of just need to, uh, practice, right? With anything, with whatever you're playing. Uh, and hey, here's, here's this guy who's pretty popular right now. Haomaru from Samurai Showdown. There's also Rose and Rogue from Power Stone in the background. Billy Khan there. A lot of good characters. There's Billy Khan's sister, who is, I think, in one of those games. I was trying to do the, um, trying to do his super. 
Can I actually pause and check his move list in this one? Look at Morgan's ancient sprite, though. It's a meme. Command list. Okay, so how do I do his supers? Buster Wolf is double quarter circle and kick. Got it. That's all I need. Cool. That Morgan sprite is older than the pyramids. And I love how... Like, it's a joke, but Morgan hasn't gotten a new sprite since... um, Like, it took her till Tatsunoko versus Capcom to get a new sprite. That is very short range. Nice. Okay. I love the fact that this game has like the light, medium, heavy system. I wonder if I can go light, light, medium, medium, heavy, heavy. It's kind of Skull girls -y, right? I don't know. If you want to play with the big boys, you better learn how to block better. Dang called out so there are super tough secret bosses i don't think i'll be getting to them if you want to see them uh watch um max play it because i'm not gonna get to it there's no way so i did uh try and uh, yeah i was gonna say i tried to play as, as another character here I'm one of those freaks who actually thinks Ryu is a fun character. Like, I know so Okay, so he doesn't have Donkey Kick. I know some people legitimately hate Ryu as a character because he's quite boring. But no, I like him. I wonder if the opponents there also always pick the same group as you. If so, that's interesting. Come on. The backgrounds being 3D very much remind me of, like, Marvel vs. Capcom 2, which is always a good thing. I do like the, the like, idea of this era of Capcom, where you have, like, the 3D backgrounds, and it just, it looks good. It's a damn shame we'll never get another 2D Capcom game. Okay, let me see here. Trying to do supers with him. Doesn't seem to work. Do I? I have supers in this form, right? Double. I was trying to do a double quarter circle forward. It, it, weird. Maybe. Maybe the Garo style doesn't let you do supers. I haven't seen one yet. All right. All right. So there's GP up there, which is like your general score. I think you need a thousand to get to the secret boss and stuff. And you need to get, I think, a lot of first attacks as well. So we'll see if we get to... So Kyosuke here is a rival school's character. He's like a 3D character getting his 2D sprite for the first time, which is wild. I'm actually going to try switching to stick mode and seeing if that'll make it easier. Oh, there's your super. So yeah, you do use your meter. Okay, left stick mode does not work. Got it. You have to use the D-pad, I guess, for this game. Okay, I'm trying to shore you and it's not working. Why is it... It might be my stick. It's a bit... It's not... Like, it's good. It's a, it's a tournament edition Mad Cats, but... That might be why I'm not getting my supers and stuff out. You were already giving up? You didn't even try. Dang, dude, called out. So we'll try a uh, Ken this time. I know CVS2 Ken is in some people's minds. The peak Ken. So we're gonna give it a try here. This battle is about to explode. Relento here. There we go, I got one. And no, they, they will have other grooves there. His role is quarter circle back punch, huh? Interesting. Okay, okay. I do know he has the uh, the crazy kicks, which we know now of from uh, 
from Marvel, or from, from Capcom there. Or, sorry, Smash! Oh my god, talking and playing video games is hard. Oh god. I've heard, I've heard horror stories of, of CBS2 Sagat. Almost as bad as Vanilla. Vanilla 4 Sagat. Okay, we got that. Okay, okay, okay. I think the, uh, the King of Fighters system here of 3v3 is actually pretty fun. I was not sure about it at first, because I was like... Okay, let's see, what's his super so we know when we get to it? I mean, I'm gonna guess it is... Oops, hi. Um, okay, so Shinryu can Repa, or Shoryu Repa would be quarter circle forward. It's double, okay, pretty much it's double Shoryu motion. I'm trying to do it. You can obviously hear it. Ah, that's tough to do. The supers in this are definitely not lenient to say the least. But if you saw there his uh his his um Shin Shin Ryuk in there with the fire, boy it goes far. Boy it goes incredibly far. You can definitely feel a lot of Smash Ken in came from this. Like this this variant of him. Alright, we're gonna go back to our boy Terry, though. Uh, I don't know who that first person is. That is, uh, there's still some on that SNK side that I'm like, I don't know you. Aw, oh, I love this stage! Cause there's like the power, there's, there's, um, Falcon over there. There's Alex in the background, I never noticed him. That's just his, that's just his third strike arc. Also, who is this Melty Blood character? Ah, look, there's Leona and, and Falcon! Edward Falcon! God, it's so good. It's just a damn shame that Power er, Power Stone is not remembered like this anymore. Vega, alright. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh boy. Come on. I am not gonna ever be able to do a super with him. Woo! Woo! That was spicy. I actually liked playing Vega a lot in Street Fighter V, and that's just because some of the stuff you can do with him is... is... whack. Speaking of, hi Raiden! It's been a lot hot time, long time since we've seen you, huh? So Raiden is the heel version of Big Bear, if I'm correct? Which is wild, concept-wise. Alright, there we go. Okay! We got 800. That, I think, is enough to get to the secret boss, if I'm right. There's a concept of a finesse victory. Yeah, here we go. There's a finesse victory thing, where it's like you have to do certain, certain ways of doing it. Yeah, it's Bipsin! And Bison! We gotta beat this dude. Next location is my Robbie. All right, mid boss here. I think it's geese. Otherwise, so it's a case of gotta beat him. Is about to explode. I fought Bison enough to know exactly what to do here. Kind of. He's different in different zones. That did he just spot dodge? He must have the spot dodge. Yeah, that's, that's S group. That's a spot dodge. This S group is a uh, classic KOF. Oh, bust out wolf! Nice, we got one off. Yeah, they. Oh, double KO, huh? Okay. I mean, I have more characters, so I win, right? Because it was one. 
Terry got run over by a car. Never given. Yeah, now it's Ryu that gets that gets picked up. Of course, because he's next. All right. Osaka here. In the final bout, I'll show off everything I've got. This should prove to be a worthy battle. Aight. Let's go. We got uh, Kyo. And we got uh, Vice. I always get Vice, Mature, and King mixed up in my head. They're all perfect, though. They're all the best. Is he charging? I oh, because of course he has he has um the classic group there that has the charging. Oh, didn't mean to rise and tackle there. I tried to tried to but knuckle. That would have been cool if that hit. Okay, I'll. Of course, his Shinku Hadoken here is not a giant beam like I expected, because that's that's Marvel. This is this is more grounded. All right, Kyo, you may be the main character of, of King of Fighters, but I invented King of Fighters, literally. Well, no, actually, Rio did because it's art of fighting. But hey, I popularized it. That was a near perfect. That should have been regarded as a perfect. Aight. Vice. Boy, you are perfection. So it's very obvious if you're looking at the actual, like, graphics and stuff. Capcom just straight up, um... Like, traced over some of the... Can you... Can you do it? Nope. Okay. Guess not. Uh, Capcom traced over a lot of the original sprites, which, you know what? I kind of like that, because it's traced them over in their style. It's like, it's good. I we did it. We beat... Great battles. That's how to outplay and outwit. The mark of the millennium is done. Outfight, rather. The champion of the martial arts has just been decided. The title goes to... The strongest trio, Terry, Ryu, and Ken. Are we going to have uh, another interruption? I now present all you fans the best of the best. Listen to the cheers. The roaring applause won't stop. This concludes the Mark of the Millennium Tournament live from Osaka, Japan. It's about time we signed off. See you next time. Oh, did I actually not? Oh! da done. Whom? Oh, we didn't get to the secret boss. Because I sucked. Well, uh, there is a way to get further. And you would then fight either Rugal or Akuma. And if you beat them, then you fight either Shin Akuma or God Rugal. Um, I am not that good. I suck. As you can tell from my inability to do supers. Uh, but hey, we did it. Again, if you would like to see a breakdown of how to get to those those bosses, uh, go watch um, Maximilian Dude. Uh, he did a boss rage on CBS2, and it's so perfect I'd never top it, so I'm not gonna try. I know that sounds defeatist, but honestly, he loves that game way more than I do. All right. I will be back when I have friends to play this with. Um, let's just see. Is there anything else to take a look at here? Training, replay, survival. I love color edit. What a good mode. Like, just the ability to grab a character here. And just be like, what type of... What type of a, a, a Terry do you want? You can start from a base color. Okay, let's take a look at these, because these are these will be like his smash colors, right? Like, let's see here. So we got regular. We got brown, so that, this looks a bit like it's trying to be Garo. I hope we don't get that in Smash. I hope we just get the Garo alt. 
This is one with like a different red with green pants. This is one I could see Smash putting in for, for like that's like the Richter second blue. The blue will definitely be in. That's a player two color. I'm not a fan of the orange. I'm not. And the green, the green's good too. That's pretty good. That's pretty stylish. That looks like his uh, grow second color too. And then the gray and the black, yeah, it's nice. So we see a lot of his colors here. So if I wanted though, what I could do is I could say like, okay, we're gonna take this. I we're gonna take the, the gray of his hat here. I we're instead turn it to like hot pink. Right, like we, we, could, we could do that. And then, yeah, so then we'll go to this one, which is gonna be a hotter pink. We really want him to look just extra beautiful hotter pink would be like this right no that's 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 too red how do i get it to be a hotter pink would it be more up yeah there you go even more well not a hot pink there you go that's pink and this will be a dark pink so we'll be up and then this will be like this Color palettes are hard. Um, that'll be black. That's fine as white. That, let's make this part of him though, instead of that, let's make it like, yeah. Uh, so that, then his pants and stuff. So yeah, as you can see, it is, it is, it is palettes. And we can give him different color hair if we want. So if we want, we can give him cool black hair, edgy. Wait, black would be all up, right? Um, it is a cool system, but it is limited by the fact that, yes, you have to... Uh, no, I'm wrong. It is down all the way. Um, it is limited by you must make sure that all the colors and stuff are uh, abiding by the palettes. Like, you can't just say just the hair and stuff. Black hair. Yeah, so that's kind of fun. You can play around with that. Save that into the slot. And uh, it, it, it will be tough to... And I think it actually saves over that color. So I don't know which color we chose for it. It's like if we if we go exit here. Um, the color and the name you have decided, press start to use it. So if we wanted, we could go like training. We could go to... Where's the stage we haven't been to? I don't think we've been to this one. We'll go to... K Groove. And it said to press start to choose it, right? So we'll go start there. Uh, we'll go just one there. And we'll go C. And you know what? We'll have him beat up. Beat up a little rock there. Alright. So let's see how this comes out looking. I do love the fact that the... If you choose C Groove, you get Capcom artwork for characters. Like any of the CAP, Capcom artwork, you choose the SNK, you get, um, you get artwork for, um, from, from SNK there. Wow, this Terry looks cursed. I don't like Terry with, with, uh, with the dark hair. It looks real cursed. He looks way more, in this alt, he looks way more Native American than anything. Buster Wolf still looks good. Can we do, uh... Power Wave Super 2. It is a triple piece of cool. All right. Well, that about does it. There's not much else to say. This is definitely another game like Garo where it's like, yeah, it's a short campaign, but it's it's made by the multiplayer, which is this is like one of the best ones. So if you if you want to play a good game featuring many of the boys from Smash, they're all here. Uh, you can pick up this one. It's on PS3. Uh, otherwise, it's on Dreamcast, or you can get, of course, there's like MAME and arcades and stuff. So, yeah, thank you all for watching, everyone. We'll see you next time for some more. Uh, the path to, or it's the road. Gotta remember the word. The road to Terry Bogard. Ciao. All records are made to be broken.